we have an email from Caesar of Del Sur, California. Hey Paul, does your Puntu Live CD have a utility for securely wiping a hard drive? Does this answer your question? For show, for show, for show. <laughs> Do you like Ubuntu? Do you like to hack? Do you need various tools to troubleshoot PCs? Do you hate girly purple? Then you need to try Bauer Puntu Linux. It's a live DVD. You can install it. Run it on a USB. <laughs> we don't give a crap. Just download. Visit puntu.bauerpower.net and get ready to hack some shit up. Welcome to episode 2 of Tech Shop. I, of course, am Paul Bauer, a.k.a. Twitter.com slash Pablo. Today we're going to look at securely wiping hard drives using a Linux Live CD and a really sweet utility called Shred. Shred, of course, comes standard in Bauer Puntu Linux. <laughs> Just saying. So why is securely wiping your hard drive so important? According to this article by Tech World, 40% of hard drives purchased off of eBay have sensitive data on them. Do you want people knowing your intimate financial history? Or about your freaky foot fetish? <laughs> I didn't think so. Take a look at this article from the Daily Mail, where an eBay hard drive had details of a top-secret government missile defense system. That is why securely wiping your hard drive is so important. I'm not talking about merely formatting your hard drive either. That's not good enough. Your 80-year-old grandma could still recover data off of a hard drive that's only been formatted. No, in order to ensure that nobody's getting your goods, you have to overwrite your hard drive multiple times using random ones and zeros. Overwriting the data multiple times is the only way you can be sure that your data can't be recovered. Now let me show you how to do it using Bauer Puntu. Tech Chaw! Alright, now I've got Bauer Puntu booted up here, and um, I've got it booted up in a virtual machine uh, using VirtualBox. Um, I've already, uh, underneath it, I've got a uh, Windows hard drive uh, that I don't really care about anymore. It's a VM with running Windows, so I booted up with a live CD. And I'm going to open up a terminal here. And uh, let's go ahead and change directory over to devices. And this, and we'll just do a, an ls in here. And what we're looking for is either SDA or HDA, because those are going to be our hard drives, okay? In Linux, if you have a physical hard drive, it's going to be either HDA or SDA more uh, more times out of uh, more times than not. So here you can see here we have SDA and SDA one. Um, SDA is the actual hard drive. SDA1 is the partition that's holding Windows. All right, let's go ahead and go down here. And let's go ahead and clear. Now, all we have to do to run shred is we have to use sudo. And we'll do shred. And we'll do minus V for verbose. So that way we can see what it's doing. F. Uh, is a force erase, which means um, do whatever you have to, but you know to take uh, control so you can write on the drive. Uh, maybe wherever you're writing to, you don't have the permissions to. But this, uh, the app is forcing the permissions on there. I guess that's the best way I can describe it. I like to throw a Z on there. That throws uh, one extra, um, one extra pass of just plain zeros. So after you do all your random data, um, the last pass is just all zeros. So it's, you can't really tell that it's been securely wiped. It just looks like it's been formatted. And all right, and then the next thing we do, we do a minus N for the number of passes. Now eight or nine are probably good, so we'll do, um, but let's go, let's, let's do, let's go crazy. I think it's about 32 for a Gutman wipe, right? And we'll do dev. SDA and I do a star that makes sure that you know all the partitions everything is wiped you don't really have to do this I guess um, I see a lot of people that just do SDA but I, I like to be better safe than sorry and then we hit enter and there it goes starting past one of 33 then why do you think it says 33 instead of 32 I said 32 right it's because of the Z on there it does one extra pass of zeros right so here it's going to go through and it's going to do a pass one of, of random data and it's going to take a really, really long time. 
and I'm not going to show you it. But just trust me, after this is all done, you can go ahead and get yourself a beer or coffee or whatever. Um, but it's good to go. And then now it's ready to go on eBay and you don't have to worry about people finding about your funky sh**. Tech chaw. And that's it. Let the Shred Command run its course. Go get some coffee or crack open a beer because it's going to take a while. What do you like to use to securely wipe a hard drive? Derek's boot and nuke? Something different? Let us know in the comments. As always, if you have suggestions or if you have a question you want answered on the show, shoot me an email, info at techchop.com. That concludes this episode. Catch us here next month for your monthly dose of Tech Chop.